Hello friends, this is the seventh video tutorial inside the video lecture series on data visualization with the Python. So in this lecture, we are going to see about uh, how to load this data from the file and display it. So till now we have seen that uh, all data for individual x-axis and y-axis we are providing as a Python list data structure. But suppose we have a huge bunch of data are available inside the file then how you can provide those data to this our Python uh, matplotlib libraries individual plotting function. So let's start it. So before that we need to create some data so uh, let's do in a very simple test data file so suppose uh, first uh, x axis has a value we'll put it as a comma separated 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 okay for the second value suppose there is a 5 6 1 9 0 minus 5 suppose 3 2 9 so this is the example data we have created now what we are going to do we are going to load this file inside our python and those uh, data we will supply to our python plotting function so let's save it at the proper place we'll save it like data dot txt ok so we have saved it now let's uh, try to load this uh, data so in a numerical python library there is a one good cs these are all uh, comma separated value so either we can use the built in uh, csv uh, module of python or either we can go with but in that case we have to iterate it or we can go with a uh, ready made function available inside this numerical python library so let's uh, do with numerical python library so before that we need to import this numpy as a np okay so that's a typo uh, okay now uh, let's put whole uh, data inside this two variable first is the x value and the second one is all y value so np has load txt fun load txt function is there which will take argument of our test data dot txt file and we will supply the delimiter as a comma as a comma so there is a typo this is a typo here and yeah we need to supply the one more argument also unpack is equal to true okay so we have got all those data inside this our x and y variable the same way we have already uh, display uh, taken this data and we have generated uh, in as a python list data structure we have got all this x and y value is a python let's just verify it by printing x okay 1 to 10 so in our uh, x data is also 1 to 10 let's print y also 4 5 6 1 9 so 4 5 6 1 9 is correct actually so we have got all data inside our two python list data structure now we can easily supply to any kind of our graph like uh, let's go with a simple plot only and we will supply this to list data structure to our 
plotting function of matplotlib library let's display it okay uh, we have assigned this plt okay so it has generated the plot very basic uh, line plotting function which we used in a very uh, first lecture of this series so for the first value it is having a 4 the second is might be 5 so this has generated the value and here uh, in this case the only difference is that we have done exactly all similar thing except that we have gathered data from the file so uh, instead of just generating at a run time or hard coding all those value like this in our earlier example so this way we can load the value from uh, file also and we can uh, display the graph so that's it for this lecture uh, thank you guys for the watching i hope you enjoy listening this video please do like comment and subscribe